Hey guys, welcome to Hang With Your Homeboy, episode 16, 2013. Um, I was going to do something different today, but I decided to, uh, while I'm out and about on this beautiful day, hang out for a little bit. Um, topic of today's conversation, or homeboy session, is uh, real estate sales versus car sales. Um, sometimes I feel uh, people kind of... Um, feel that <clears throat> there's a direct correlation between real estate sales and car sales. I just want to clear the air on that right now. Not that there's anything wrong with car salesmen, um, but typically it is uh, you versus them in a car uh, car purchase. Um, in a real estate transaction, <clears throat> it is us, me, and my client, my buyer, my seller, versus them, uh, the, other, the other side, either the buyer or seller. And my goal during that process is to get you the, the highest value and price for your home if I'm selling it and get you the best deal possible uh, if, we're, if we're buying it. So, um, you know, <clears throat> a lot of people feel that, or I've heard, oh, well, you know, the more, the higher the sale price, the more money you make. Uh, well, I guess technically that's true, <clears throat> but I'll be honest with you, the difference between $2,500 and $5,000 on a sale price of your home um, is not not doesn't make a huge difference to me and and uh, I definitely would not um, would not sacrifice the joy and the uh, the um, success of getting you the best deal over a couple dollars in my pocket so know that <clears throat> there's a huge difference between car sales and real estate sales I consider myself a real estate consultant um, which usually means teammate um, when we're involved in that that process um, <clears throat> So uh, just to bring you up to speed, car sales and real estate sales are completely different. Uh, please do not confuse them going forward. Please do not insult uh, a realtor and say, well, that's kind of like being a car salesman. It is not like being a car salesman. Um, quite the contrary. So um, <clears throat> beautiful day. I just uh, felt the need to do this video. I just came from Swagger Barbershop in Belford. Big shout out to the guys there for uh, giving me my fresh cut today for this nice weekend I got ahead of me. Um, got to go hit some lunch over here at Florentino's Italian Deli in Middletown. My boys and also Charlie was the spines. Um, so it's going to be a great weekend. Um, always make Charlie work your homeboy. When you're making Charlie work your homeboy, make sure you are Charlie strong, which means you allow me and my team to represent you in the transaction every aspect of it if possible. If you want to be as strong as possible, make yourself Charlie, Charlie Strong and uh, allow me to <clears throat> introduce my teammates to you. Tiffany Egan, Christopher Jones, uh, Arbor Title, my home inspector, all along the way. If you're going to be Charlie Strong, be Charlie Strong. So if you're going to use Charlie O, be Charlie Strong. So uh, make Charlie O your homeboy. Um, thanks for stopping by. Um, have yourself a great weekend. We're going to send it out like we always do, you know. Oh, homeboy. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great weekend, guys.